What's up guys, Smudge Beans here and welcome to a tutorial on how to build a Minecraft castle. Now you may have seen some videos of mine in the past where I've built different castles throughout Minecraft but they're all kind of similar. Today I'm going to show you how to build one of these huge castles for yourself in Minecraft. This is just like a rough tutorial showing you my mindset of what I go through when I build these castles and hopefully you can use this knowledge to build yourself a unique and amazing castle. Also I will be using World Edit in this tutorial just to speed things up. You don't have to use it but I'll be showing some tips using World Edit that are very useful. So you want to start out by building a layout of all your towers or turrets or buildings. You're going to want to have one massive main building and I've chosen circle for the shape of this but you can choose square if you want to. It's really up to you. Now you can lay out your towers any way you want. You can't really go wrong here. Though I do advise to make each circle a different size. Do not do all the same size as it just looks a bit weird. You'll notice that real life castles, all the towers and buildings are different sizes. Now I've created these cylinders using a simple world edit command as you can see on the screen here. You can do this manually if you want but the world edit really does help speed up making these cylinders. Now you're going to want to start building your towers up. Remember once again variety is key. Do not do all the towers the same height as it just looks a bit weird. I tend to make the main tower either the biggest or the second biggest then randomly do the other ones different heights. At this point you want to start adding other buildings onto your castle as well other than just the towers and also start linking everything together so it makes one big building. Next up you're going to want to start working on the top of your towers and making them look nice and pretty and stuff. Don't worry about windows yet. Also you're going to want to choose a colour theme for your castle. Now I chose the colour purple and I'm going to be using purple clay for the roofs of every building on my castle. You can choose two colours if you want. Purple and pink would work perfectly well. Now once again I do a variety of roofs for the different towers so make sure to mix them up, choose different rules, mess around with it a little bit, just have fun creating your roofs. Now for the top of the tower it's a bit too big just to place a massive roof on it so I decided to do some turrets and then this little weird design thing here. You can go wild with this, you can do whatever you want. I've done loads of different things like this in the past. You can layer it, you can stack it up, you can make it go thinner, you can make it go wider, whatever you want. At the moment it's looking quite plain but we haven't added the windows yet and I've got a lot of different tower designs here with a variety of roofs and such. Windows are the next thing that I do and windows you just go wild with. You make patterns, that's what I tend to do, just different up and down, different types of windows. As you can see here on the screen, adding them all over the place in random spots. Just trying to bring some daylight into this quite dingy castle. So next up we can add what I like to call the fancy bits, which is basically just going around all the windows and stuff and adding in lines around in different colours to make it look a little bit prettier. This is good for making your build stand out and not be completely flat. And just adds a bit of texture to the build. So I got to this point and I realised I've messed up a little bit because this stone brick just does not go with the clay. But we can fix that. So I'm going to do a simple world edit which is basically slash slash replace stone bricks with quartz to make this Dun, 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 dun. white. Oh, that looks so much better. That looks so much better. So now time to add some flags on and stuff like that just to add like the finishing touches on the main castle part. And now we're going to move on to the wall. The front gate is probably one of the more important parts of the build as it is the first thing you see when you walk into the massive castle you've just built. So here is me building just a gate. You can work with the design how you want really. I normally go for two towers on each side and some sort of fancy thing in the middle of them. You want to build it about five blocks wide as well because you're going to be building a wall to go around the edge and you want to be able to walk on that wall so five blocks wide is normally a decent width. So I'm building two walls today. I'm building a diagonal wall as you can see here and I'm also going to be building a straight wall and diagonal walls are cool because they add a bit of texture to the build rather than just having straight lines everywhere. To have something that's not completely straight is nice once in a while. Although the straight wall also does look quite cool as you can put towers in between between. I even put a little bit in the middle just to spread it up and finish off with like a little pattern to make it look nice. So there you have it. That's my quick step guide on how to build a castle in Minecraft. Obviously it takes quite a while to do this so you need to set aside like a good five or six hours or so but it's my method of building these ginormous structures and I enjoy building them and I hope you enjoyed this video and it was somewhat helpful to you in some way. Thank you for watching. Goodbye.